brain in the head is where we consciously think. The brain in the belly is where we can consciously be. What we're going to do is look at four ways in which the breath can be welcomed into the body. They're not just different ways of welcoming the breath into the body, they elicit a different state of being. When you compromise your breath, you compromise your being, so that your connection with your own being is diminished as the breath is diminished, as it fills less and less of the body. Find the tailbone, let the tailbone just drop. Find that spaciousness in the pelvic floor, and then lift yourself up from the perineum. In the scale of things, when doing arises from your being, it's empowered by your being. When doing happens independent of your being, it loses those roots, that connectedness, that bodily wisdom. In the course of the exercises, what we're hoping to do is to soften the body and heighten the sensitivity and find the place of groundedness that enables us to experience that other pole of our consciousness. Our culture tends to set up an either-or scenario, so we're either in an analytical, rational place, or we move into a place where we feel and come into relationship. My work is different. It's about finding a way to marry those two 